Rents are going up everywhere and they're going up on every one. Rent prices across the valley, as he said, are rising by hundreds of dollars for renters. A new study found five of the top 15 rental price increases across the country were right here in the valley. Scottsdale ranked number three on the ranking by apartment list, which based estimates off of rent prices listed on that website. Mesa, Phoenix, Glendale, Chandler were all in the top 15. Michael Raimondi's on this story live in downtown Phoenix, showing us how those higher prices are impacting people. Michael. Well, Yetta, everybody we talked to pretty much down here tonight has heard or seen for themselves all the rent hikes here across the valley. And all that increasing money for their bills each month basically made them, or forced them rather, to make a decision. And that was either pay the bills or find somewhere else to live. Paying more money to rent in the valley. I've had at least 100 calls today. It's been nonstop. Ken Volk is the president of Arizona Tenants Advocates. He says dozens of people every day call him complaining about rent going up. It's a very intense issue these days. I've had people calling me about rents going up $800 a month, $900 a month. Apartment List ranked five valley cities in the top 15 for her highest rent hikes since last year. But Voke says the higher prices are everywhere. The whole hell's breaking loose. Uh, Lindsay Foster knows firsthand. I like, like this area, but it's not worth it for how much I was paying. She had to move out of Phoenix for a better deal. Her complex was going to charge her $300 more a month. And I literally was living like paycheck to paycheck and had no money left over to literally do anything. Voke says that builders can't put up rental spaces fast enough for all the people moving here. He believes prices are peaking right now. They're going up on every one. This is, uh, this is not socially limited, you know, it's, it's, it's widespread. Now there is no limit on landlords here in Arizona and Volk says he does not expect these prices to come down anytime soon. Reporting live in downtown Phoenix tonight, Michael Raimondi for Arizona's Family.